Today we're on Anthem of the Seas for a seven night cruise to the Bahamas and I'm going to take you along for the whole vacation. So we set out our luggages the night before and we headed over and drove to the cruise port. So we just checked in and we're going to show you around the ship and take you along with us. We're about to go on the North Star viewing pod and I'm afraid of heights. balcony room on Anthem of the Seas. So you get a king size bed, storage, and then you have a full size mirror over here. And then this is the bathroom. Shower, standard cruise ship bathroom. We have a TV. And then over here, we just have the balcony. Now that the shipping crates moved away, this is our balcony two chairs and a little table and then we're leaving out of the Cape Liberty port that's in New York, New Jersey. So now that we checked into our room I wanted to tell you a little bit how the North Star went. So the North Star is like kind of like a Ferris wheel thing but um, it basically takes you up above the cruise ship and it gives you a really beautiful view. So we're sailing out of Cape Liberty, New Jersey. So we got to see the New York skyline, but I was a little nervous at first cause I'm scared of heights, but I thought it was worth it and it was really pretty and it was a good experience. So if you're a little nervous of heights, still do it and it'll be a great time. But now I'm just unpacking in the room and then we're going to do the skydiving simulator. Also, this is my outfit for day one of the cruise. I have on a three people sweater and then these boot cut leggings from Erie. Gonna dance on the floor all night. Make the most of this one lifetime. It's feeling like Um, which is an add-on you can get at the spa but it has a sauna a steam room and also a tropical rain shower and these nice heated spa chairs so we're just gonna enjoy some time at the spa and i brought a book with me so i'm gonna read nick and noelle's christmas playlist since it is a christmas cruise and I'll show you what each of the spa things look like. So we have a dry heat chamber, a steam room, some thermal chairs, and then over here we have the tropical rain shower and there's different settings you can do. They have tropical rain, cold mist, and Caribbean storm. And then it's a nice little spa shower. Let's try tropical rain.
day two and we got back to our room for breakfast and we got an elephant towel. The weather was really rough as we were heading down to Florida, but as we got closer, it started to improve. Since today is a sea day, we just went to the solarium and spent some time swimming and went back to the spa again. And we also checked out the Windjammer Buffet and they had this really cool Christmas gingerbread set up. Then we put our formal outfits on and got ready for a dinner at Wonderland, which is one of the specialty restaurants on board. I was able to get a full three course vegan meal, which was very nice that they were accommodating. And they also had these really cool menus where you actually paint with water to see the menu items. To one, you see the magical word? It's Abra. Abra. Good Abra. You ever heard that one before? Thank you. For my appetizer, I had this vegetable beef platter, and then my husband had these water shooters as well as a bird's nest. For my entree, I had mushrooms stuffed with vegetables inside, which was really good. And for dessert, I had a fudge brownie, which was my favorite. back to the cabin from formal night and we ate our dinner at wonderland and then we went to go see a magic show but the ship has been really rocky so all the theater shows have been canceled so far and our florida stop has also been canceled we're going to be docking there for two hours but we're not going to be getting off the ship so our next stop is going to be Coco Cay and tomorrow's going to be another day at sea. So I'll show you what we do at sea for day three. It's currently day three on the cruise and today we're going to be going to Port Canaveral, Florida. And since the weather improved, we're going to be able to dock again. So we're going to be here from around 3 p.m. to 8 p.m. So we'll see if we get off the ship and any activities we do. But right now, we're gonna go head to the solarium and the spa to do some hot tubbing. This is the weather currently. This is my outfit, so. I did a white headband from Target, and then I have my top from Abercrombie, and then I'm just wearing this blue skirt from Hollister. And that's why I wear a casual day. the ship and we're at Port Canaveral so we're walking to this park and beach 
and there were no Ubers or Lyfts available. So we decided to just walk straight down the port to the beach. So let's see what it has. We even got swans over here at this little park. Now we're gonna walk over and see if there's more to the park or if there's a beach down here. It's cool. We just walk down the street from the port. Let's go see it. 